All right, so I'm going to show you how to do statistics calculations in the Windows calculator. We just got to make sure it's in scientific mode. I'm sure you know, but just in case, it's in the view menu. Say scientific. All right. Now, first, what you're going to want to do is click the STA button. This is short for statistics. See how those buttons are disabled there? You're going to want to click on this to enable them. Oh, you got the statistics box. Okay. It's got four buttons in it, a list box, and at the bottom it says N equals zero. Now, let's add some values to it, okay? So to do that, we're gonna do like, it's so under in 45. Click that to add it, see? Now it says N equals one. See, that counts the number of values in there. Now, you can do like, I'll add like 20. 25, 30, okay, is that, yep, there, 45, 20, 25, 30, and now, let me show you what the buttons do, there's RET, R-E-T, which just puts the main calculator window in front, then there's LOAD, which, select a number, select that, and it'll put that number in the display, then there's CD, which deletes a number and that's currently selected, and then CAD, which clears the whole list. I'll show you that when I'm done. You can click now, click AVE, and you'll get the average, which is 30. Click SUM, and you get the sum or total of all the numbers in the list. You can click S, I think this gives you the standard deviation, pretty sure. And then that's how you do statistics. And now let me show you these buttons. You can do CD, which just deletes the selected value, and then CAD, clears the whole list. Okay, it's simple as that. See ya.